Heavenly Father, I want to take this time to pray, Father God, this year, Heavenly Father, for all um, the lambs, Father God, uh, blessings for the new year of 2019, Father God, for all the lambs out there, Father God, this year of 2019, I want to pray your blessings upon all the lambs that are your people and all the lambs, Father God, that are not yet your children yet, Father God. For this year, 2019, Father God, first of all, I pray that you will cover all the wonderful lambs out there, Father God, with the blood of Jesus Christ, from the crown of their heads to the soles of their feet, with the blood of Jesus Christ in Jesus Christ's name, and that you will cover all the lambs out there, their spirits, souls, and bodies, and their lives, their minds, their personalities, wills, intellects, emotions and moods and temperaments, Father God, sexuality, virginities, testosterones, Father God, the callings and destinies, Father God, and ministries and work of their hands that you have, Father God, for these lambs out here, Father God, these wonderful lambs out here, with the blood of Jesus Christ, in Jesus Christ's name. Help me, Father, I ask in Jesus Christ's name that you release your angelic uh, guardian angels and angelic sheriffs to protect all lambs today, 24-7 today and every day, Father God, from all evil danger and harm and from evil predators and evil spiritual people, in Jesus Christ's name and from demons and from witchcraft attacks, in Jesus Christ's name that your angels will bind up and defeat and destroy Father God, all principality, devils, powers, rulers of darkness and wickedness in high places, demons that come against them in any nation that any of these lambs are living in, Father God, in any part of this world, Father God, and anywhere in America, anywhere in Canada, and any nation and country in this world, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, where any of the lambs live, in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. I pray, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, that you release your guardian angels to keep evil people away from the lambs, predators, and evil people that want to hurt any of the lambs, any of your people, any of your children, any of the innocents, Father God, from children to adults, Father God, that are being persecuted through any given slavery program or not outside of a program, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. So, Father God, I just pray that you will bestow your blessings and your countenance and your grace and your mercy and your love and your kindnesses and tender mercies, Father God, upon all lambs, Father God. In Jesus Christ's name, especially the ones that are being very persecuted through any given slavery program in this world, in America, and in Canada, and also upon me as well as being one of your children, Heavenly Father, in Jesus Christ's name. I ask Heavenly Father God in Jesus Christ that this year of 2019 that you, Father God, would have your way with the lambs. Your will would be done in their lives, Father God. Whatever plans and good plans, Father God, that you have for the lambs out there, for your people, for your children, for the innocents, and for myself, Father God, that your perfect and divine will would be done in the lives of the lambs and in my life as well in Jesus Christ's name and that you will have your way in our lives Father God you will have your way in my life in the lives of all the lambs out there and the lives of all the persecuted lambs out there that are being persecuted through any given slavery program in Jesus Christ's name everywhere in this world everywhere in America everywhere in Canada in Jesus Christ's name Father God I also pray Father God that you will surround the lambs Father God, with your presence of peace and comfort, with your comforting hands and your comforting angels, and with your presence of joy 
and your presence, Father God, and the presence of your guardian angels and your comforting angels, Father God, and your ministering angels, and that you release your ministering angels to all lambs to minister to the lambs day and night and any time of the day, Father God, and to minister encouragement and love and kindness to the to the lambs and to me, Father God, as well, in Jesus Christ's name, as one of your lambs, as one of your children, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, I ask Heavenly Father that you, Heavenly Father God, will release your countenance, Father God, and your graces and your favor upon all lambs, upon your children, upon your people, upon the innocents, upon me as one of your children, Father God, and that you extend your favor, your kindness, and your grace out to all lambs out there, everywhere in this world, everywhere in America and Canada, and and to me, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. Heavenly Father, I just pray in Jesus Christ's name for this year of 2019, Father God, that you will make it possible, Father God, And extend your mercy out to bring blessings upon all lambs. All lambs that are suffering through any type of persecution. All lambs that are not suffering through anything. But Father God, that you would just pour out your blessings upon them. Your blessings of peace. Your blessings of peace. Father God, your blessings of love. Your blessings of kindness. Your blessings of tranquility. Your blessings of serenity and contentment. Your blessings of shaloms. Your blessings of well-being. Your blessings of welfare and security. Your blessings, Father God, of insurance. Father God, your blessings, Father God, of security, protection, provision, Your blessings of prosperity and success, Father God, in the lives of all the lambs and in my life as well, Father God, in the lives of all your people, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. The blessings, Father God, of your grace, your mercy, Father God, your forgiveness, Father God, your deliverance, your salvation, Father God, the blessings, Father God, of your judgment of your um, good judgment and discretion, Father God, and discernment among your people and wisdom and knowledge and understanding and revelation and insight and foresight and guidance and direction, Father God, and the blessings, Father God, of breakthrough, Father God, and Edens and your God suddenlies, Father God, and Carmel's and rows of Sharon's, Father God, upon all your people and the lambs and upon me as one of your people as well. In Jesus Christ's name, this year of 2019, I pray, Father God, that you will release, Father God, your power to open up heaven, the gates of heaven for your people, Father God, and for the lambs, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. I pray, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, that you release your floodgates of flavor. I mean, your your floodgates of favor, of favor upon your lambs, upon your people, and upon me. Father God, your floodgates of favor. Father God, in Jesus Christ, in every era of our lives, in the lives of your people, and the lambs, and myself, in my life, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. I pray that you will bestow favor in every era of the lives of all the lambs and your people and your children. And in my life, Father God, as one of your people, in Jesus Christ's name. I pray, Heavenly Father, in Jesus Christ, Father God, that you will restore everything in our lives that the devil and his demons have stolen from us. That you will bring jubilee. Nation, jubilation, Father God, rejuvenation, rather, rejuvenation, Father God, and jubilee, Father God, some kind of way in our lives, Father God, and it doesn't have to come in the form of things or monies or nothing, Father God, but just to jubilee spiritually, to just of healings. Father God, of healings and restorations in our souls to restore our souls and our minds and our bodies and and our 
self-esteem and our peace and our joy, Father God, that only joy and peace come from you through your son, Jesus Christ, Father God, uh, to all lambs and your people and to me in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. And I just pray, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, Father God, that you, Father God, would restore Release the blessings of just breakthrough and just healings of your healing power, Father God, and your healings upon our bodies and our minds and our personalities and our wills, Father God, and our souls, Father God, and our bodies, and that you will heal relationships in our lives, Father God, and finances and pocketbooks, Father God, that you will heal and, re- and deliver us from breaches and Father God in our lives, Father God. I pray that you will heal us and break all the evil gaps out of our lives, Father God, and, and deliver us from the evil mountains in our life and remove the evil mountains, Father God, that are in our way, Father God, the obstacles of evil mountains that are just holding us back from you, holding us back from getting closer to you and deeper in you and your word, Father, and getting in a deeper relationship and cultivating a relationship with you and spending uh, quality time with you and getting deeper and growing in a relationship with you that's keeping us from doing what you want us to do and be in obedience in your word and the will of your life, Father God, that we will be in alignment to your will, Father God, that you will bless us with alignment to be into you and to be into Jesus, to be aligned to Jesus, to be aligned to the will that you have for us and aligned to the obedience of your word, Father God, to the submission of your word, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name and submission to the will that you have for us in our individual lives and that you have for me in my life, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, Father God. I pray, Father God, that you will bestow upon all the lambs good health in every area of their lives, Father God, healthy relationships, Deliver us from toxic people, unhealthy people, healthy finances, healthy habits, Father God. Deliver us from addictions, Father God, addictive spirits, Father God, spirits of addictions in Jesus Christ's name, that you will give us, bless us with healthy food and nutritious water and food, Father God, and wholesome food in Jesus Christ's name, Father God, to bless us and bestow us of those things, Father God, and and good resources, Father God, and that you will just bless us with healthy relationships and social interactions and social fellowship and healthy financial habits and father God and that you would just bless us with divine health and strength and energy father God and help us to keep our bodies clean and safe and healthy and to do exercise and eat healthy or whatever and stay away from unhealthy mediums and unhealthy people in Jesus Christ's name father God and unhealthy spirits in Jesus Christ's name. And I pray that you would deliver us from evil spirits, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name, that we struggle with an evil spirit to people that we struggle with in Jesus Christ's name from controllers and handlers and abusers and losers and users, Father God, and oppressors and bullies, Father God, and witches and warlocks and stuff, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. I pray that you will bless us, Father God, with all types of deliverances and breakthroughs that we need in our lives in this year of 2019. That you will bless us with breakthrough in our prayer lives, Father God, for all the lambs out there that are praying and crying out to you for everything and standing on your uh, the promises of your word, Father God, and trusting in you. Father God, put their trust in you and that you will help us to increase in trusting in you, that you will release the increase of trust in you, trust in you and to trust you and not in trusting in people, not trusting in ourselves, nor in people, nor in the devil, but trusting in you, Lord, only in trusting in Jesus, Father God, your son. So, Father God, in your word, I thank you, Father God, for helping me to trust in you more in your word and in Jesus Christ and get closer to you and and hold on to the garment of Jesus and grab on to Jesus and never let him go. In Jesus Christ's name and to be more like you. Father, I thank you for helping us to be 
Bless and being obedient to your word and being obedient to you and listen to your voice, Father God, and blessing us as we be obedient to you and your word, Father God, in Jesus Christ's name. I thank you, Father God, for helping us to be blessed, to walk in obedience in you.